Hey guys, my name is Elena, I'm a graphic designer and this is my channel for beginners in Adobe Illustrator. And today, in this difficult time for all of us, I decided to add some fun in our lives. And I'm going to show you how to draw this cute emoji with medical mask. If you're interested, please keep watching. This is our workspace and this is our colors. Ok guys, let's start. Now I'm going to create an emoji. We need to take an ellipse, hold shift, ok great. Now we need to create a perfect gradient for our emoji. Well done, perfect. Move the gradient a little up. Ok, make it bigger. Yes, I love it. Ok, now I'm going to create eyes. We need an ellipse. Ok. Uh -huh. This anchor move a little up. Ok, ok, great. Uh -huh. I think very cute eye. And now let's create 3D effect for our eye. The need offset buff, I think uh, 2 it's enough. Ok, perfect. And now let's colorize our 3D effect in color of our emoji. Ok, that's great. And now let's make gradient for our eyes. Sorry, our eye. Great. Let's make a copy, group, copy and paste. Ok, now transform reflect vertical. Great. Ok, our eyes are ready. Let's move them a little down. I think it will be looks more cute. And now let's create the highlight for our eye. We need gradient from white to black and radial. Ok, great. Move it here. Move the emoji and the highlight back and eyes looks more cuter. Ok, now let's create the cheeks. They need the red color. Ok. Effect. Blur. Gaussian blur. Ok, 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 ok. Here. Ok. Great. Love the, the cheek. Opacity 50. Copy and paste the cheek and make the second cheek. Now I'm going to create the medical mask, but at first we need to lock our emoji, group it, ok, here, and lock. Ok, our emoji is locked. Let's start to create the medical mask. We need the rectangle. Ok, great. Mm -hmm. 
let's take direct selection and move this anchor here and this here. Great. Now effect warp. Okay, let's take these. Uh huh. Like that. Great, okay. Object, expand appearance. Again, warp. And now these. Okay. Move it a little here. Okay, create object, expand appearance, move it, move it a little up, great, great, okay, now effort, and round corners, 20 is great, okay, object, expand appearance, okay, move, add anchor, and move, with help of direct selection, these anchor a little down. Okay. Now take this anchor and, and move it a little up. Okay, that's great. Now this is the basic of our mask. Let's create the inside buff, offset buff. Okay, minus 10, great, change the color, make it a little bigger, great, now we need an ellipse, mm -hmm, great like that, now copy and paste this part of the mask, Group, Effect, Pathfinder, Intercept, Object, Expand Appearance, OK, great. Now copy and paste this part of the mask, send backward and move it a little down, black and white gradient, and white, and a little light gray move like that great the white color the white color in the middle multiply great effect blur gaussian blur okay like that great i love it now we need the rectangle, ok, here, great, now copy and paste this part of the mask, group, effect, pathfinder, intercept, object, expand appearance, great, change the color, Copy and paste this part and move it backward and a little down. And now this gradient, multiply, uh, they need to add an anchor here, direct selection, move a little up, great, effect, blur, Gaussian blur, ok. Now, with help of direct selection, select these anchors and move a little down. Now we need twice copy and paste this part of the mask. One of them move a little down. And here, great. Now group, effect, pathfinder, exclude, object, expand appearance. Delete unnecessary part, great, and copy and paste this part, backward, a little down, and these gradients, multiply, effect, 
blur, Gaussian blur. Okay, great. These anchors with help of direct selection move a little down. Great, I love it very much. Now, copy and paste this part of the mask. Move it in front. Select all, unselect this part. Mask, make clipping mask. Great. Now a little decorate our mask buff, offset buff. Minus 5. Okay. That's great. It looks like stitched with threads. Let's play a little the settings. Mm, I think that will be great. Mm, let's make here one. Yes, great, I love it. Look. Mm, so cute. And now let's a little zoom. And now I'm going to create ties. Take the brush, uh, that brush, okay, and just draw. Great. And here. Great. And a little zoom. And here. And here. Okay, great. And now let's make them more realistic. We need to move our mask in front, select it, unselect this. Ok, arrange to front, great. Now let's delete unnecessary part, then delete this pen. Let's draw like that. Now expand appearance for this tie and group it. Effect, Pathfinder, Exclude, Object, Expand Appearance and Ungroup and delete unnecessary. Great. The same here, the pen, let's draw like this, great, object, expand appearance, group, effect, path enter, exclude, object, expand appearance, ungroup, delete, great. Ok, we need again to move our mask in front, unselect this and edge, bring to front, great, this expand appearance and this expand appearance, great. Now we need to create the background. At first let's unlock our emoji, group it with the mask. And now let's take the rectangle. Great. Move it back. Okay. 
And now let's make the beautiful gradient. Okay, here dark yellow, here light yellow. Let's play this gradient. Like that. I like it, very cute. And now let's create the shadow. Here. I like it very much. That's all guys. Thank you for watching. If you like my tutorial, please subscribe and give me a like. And if you have any questions, feel free to ask me. See you soon guys. Bye bye.